Hi there, I am Mrs. Green and welcome to Mrs. Green's World. And I just want to know, are you ready to get your green on? I hope so, because I am really excited to share with you my latest invention. It's a tree. It requires no soil, no water, no sunlight, no fertilizers, no composting, and you can plant an unlimited supply of them. Now, how good is that? Here we go, guys. Get ready. It's the plastic bag tree. If one falls off like this, okay, it may be a little bit harder. <laughs> you just go out in your neighborhood and find another plastic bag hanging on another tree and put it back on your little tree. You can cut it to size. Honestly, you might think the plastic tree thing is a little bit corny, but I am here to talk to you today about what I consider to be public enemy number one. Next time you're out driving, make a little game of it. Have your spouse or your kids or your grandkids join you. You will drive them crazy. See how many plastic bag trees you can count. Or if you want to, you can count how many of them blow in front of your car. Public enemy number one. Fact. The United States uses over 60,000 plastic bags every five seconds. Really, people? We can fix this. And all it takes is being aware and changing one new habit. You know how they say there's an app for that? Well, trust me, there is a plastic bag for that. You can start with this tiny, teeny little pod that's in your purse, or if you have a man purse, you can put it in there. No one will ever see it, and you can get you know, probably one in brown. And this comes up to this, okay? So you can say, well, I forget mine. We'll put it in your purse or your man purse, and you don't have to worry about it. But I buy a lot of wine. There's a bag for that. They're giving them away free at the grocery stores. Wine bag, reusable, no problem. And for that rare occasion that you find yourself bringing one home, please recycle it. Remember that it's public enemy number one. Try to never touch it. But if you do, make a little effort and take it back to the grocery store or the dry cleaner or wherever. Okay. Here's the killer, dead one for me, for public enemy number one. But I need it for my dog poop. I need it for my kitty litter. Weak, weak, weak. Forget about it. Forget about it. Okay, here we have the bio bag, okay? This is the price of a latte. 50 certified compostable bags. Now here's the rub, okay? A latte, remember, a latte. You don't need it for your dog poop anymore. You can get this if you're in Tucson at a store called Nurturing Nature for $6.99, all right? You don't need to use any more bow wow poop, bow wow waste, whatever it is you're thinking about because Mrs. Green will be trying to catch you. And I found a couple of websites. If you like to uh, order them online, you can do that. BowWowWaste.com is one. I did not make that up. And then there's another one called CrewPoo.com for your poo bags. I mean, obviously, I could not make that up. Now, about the compostable ones, there is a rub. You can't just take the dog poop, put them in your compostable bag, and throw it in the garbage where it's going to go in the landfills. You have to find a really nice place. I can tell you this, if you feed your pets healthy foods, you can use it for your compost. Not a thought I want to spend a lot of time on. However, it is compostable. You can, if you live in the desert and you have an alley or someplace, you can put it out there because these bags will biodegrade. They are not meant to be thrown again in the landfill. So please don't tell me that you're going to be getting your plastic bags 6,000 every five seconds, 60,000, sorry, every five seconds, because I'll be helping you get your green on. So join me in the crusade against public enemy number one. We don't want people coming to visit this country and think that plastic bags is our national fruit, okay? So thank you so much for joining me. Thank you, and get ready to get your green on, and trust me, I'll be watching.